In the name of Allah, the most merciful, the most gracious. Dar al Secondary School welcomes you and wishes you an interesting lesson. Uh, today, my dear students, we have a revision on Unit 1. The title of our unit is Connected by Technology. Let's begin with vocabulary, question type, matching question, uh, match each definition in column 1 with a word or a phrase in column 2. Uh, the first question, someone who likes to be alone. What does it mean? It means he is a lunar. The answer is E. Number two, someone who does not get upset easily. It means that he is uh, cool or laid back. The answer is C. Someone who makes other people laugh. It means he is a funny person. Funny. A. Someone who does not like to plan things. It means he is a spontaneous person. Spontaneous. F. Someone who is not afraid to tell the truth means he is a straightforward person, straightforward, D. Someone who likes to spend time in nature, it means he is down to earth, the, the answer is D. Someone who likes to, to do exciting things, the answer is uh, adventurous, you know. Now let's move to uh, choose the correct word, number one. Someone who likes to be alone is a space. The answer is lunar. The answer is lunar. Number two, someone who does not get upset easily. It means laid back. Number three, someone who makes other people laugh is funny. Number four, someone who does not like to plan things is spontaneous. Okay. Uh, number five. Someone who is not afraid to tell the truth, he is a straightforward person. It means he is a frank person, a frank person. Someone who likes to spend time in nature, it means he is down to earth. The answer is C. Number seven, someone who likes to do exciting things is adventurous. Uh, a person who likes adventures. Uh, a person who likes to do risky uh, actions okay now uh, question type fill in the blank fill in the blank with the correct form of do have or be we all know that do may be formed in uh, three forms do does or did have has three forms also have has or had be has five forms am is are was and where Space use, tell, go to the gym every day. We have go in the first form of the verb. So, we use do. Why do? Why didn't we use does? Because of the pronoun you. Jaina Space, been studying in the library since this morning. When I see Ben, this is verb 3. So, I must choose either have or has. When I see Jaina, I choose has. Number uh, 10, Fahad space like traveling on the, uh, talking on the phone, he would rather send text messages. Like is the first form of the verb, this is verb 1, so we're going to use uh, do or does. But with have, with Fahad, I use does. Uh, but it is in the uh, negative forms, so it is doesn't. Number 11, Jack space using my computer yesterday. Now it, it is not working properly. After before the ing form, I use am, is, are, was, or were. But when I see the word yesterday, I I know that it is uh, past progressive. So I'm going to use either was or were. But with Jack, I use was because Jack is a singular person or a, a name of a person or pronoun okay a proper name number 12 we space Ben chatting online for two hours uh, when I see Ben I must choose either have or has but with we we use have choose the correct answer uh, space you still go to the gym every day the same we have said before uh, before go we use do or does but we with the pronoun you we use do. 
Jaina Space Ben studying in the library since this morning. Uh, before Ben, I use have or has, but with Gina, I use has. Fad Space like talking on the phone. He would rather send text messages. Uh, before like, verb one, we use don't or doesn't. I cannot use isn't or aren't. So, which one is the, the correct answer? Don't or doesn't? With Fahad, I use doesn't. Jack space using my computer yesterday. Now it's not working properly. Uh, when I see ing form, I use one of verb to be forms. So, I am going to use either was or where. Uh, but with Jack, I use was. Number 12, we space Ben chatting online for two hours. Uh, before Ben, we use have or has. But with we, we use have. Choose the correct answer. Uh, I sent her a message yesterday. Uh, form a question, a yes no question. Uh, the answer is space. Send her a message yesterday. Okay. When I see second form of the verb, I begin with did. So the uh, correct answer is, did you? Matt has turned off the computer. This tense is the present perfect tense. So when I form yes, no question, I begin with have or has at the beginning. So the, the answer is, has Matt turned off the computer? Number 15, I was driving to school yesterday. When I form a question for this uh, sentence, I change I was into where you. So the, go the answer is, were you driving to school yesterday? Now, uh, transformation, change each sentence to a yes, no question. I sent her a message yesterday. The answer is, did you send her a message yesterday? Number 14, Matt has turned off the computer. The question is, has Matt turned off the computer? I am driving to school today. Uh, the question is, are you driving to school today? So, notice that I change I am into are you. Okay? Uh, this is the end of our lesson today. Thank you for watching and see you next time, inshallah. Goodbye.